Hey everyone, just wanted to say hi and a uh, little video chat about how how people treat each other in the real world and how it doesn't help sometimes. Uh, around the, the YouTube globe or around the, the you have people who post videos uh, about how much they hate the comments who you know who who used to be. Uh, used to be the, uh, a lot of people get comments like, hey, you dick face, or hey, you whatever, and it's, it, it hurts, you know? It's not something that a lot of us enjoy. They change it around so that you have to add your, 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 your uh, that you're a human and that you are a member of YouTube. If the fact is, is that the way it used to be, um, that helps for for now, but it doesn't help with the way we feel after some people say, you know, you're a dick, you're a whatever, and it, it, I don't spend, when I comment, I always say, you know, hey, that's a nice thing, or that's a, that's a nice, whatever it is, right, I always, always comment with nice remarks, but I just don't get how people can spend their time saying, hey, you're a dick, or you're a, you uh, you know, like random shit, and I just, I don't get how they do that, and I'm, I just, uh, hope that people have a better, a better sense of it now. I say, as I say, it's, it's all the way you, you treat somebody. If you treat somebody really bad, who knows, they might, you know, do something to themselves that no one really wants. If you treat them well, then they're like, oh, I'm happy, I'm, I'm enjoyable, I'm, I'm doing what I'm doing, you know. And I, I, uh, all that kind of stuff, but I, I just want to send, send that message out, is that people just don't, sometimes don't know how to treat people very well. And you're talking also about bullying, you know, you talk about people who constantly nag about, you know, this happening, or this happening, or, and you, you talk about it in high school, like, any time, like, high school has gone into, into, or school has gone into full swing since the first of last month. And, you know, every year there's another shooting, there's another killing, there's another guy who just can't take the abuse of some guy or some girl and has to walk into a, a school and say, you know, I don't like the kid would want to, himself, want to go up into a gun, buy a gun and, and do that. I think they were prodded by, prodded and egged on by friends who they didn't even want to do. I mean, I, I, I my, myself was, was told, was asked by a friend of mine in high school, you know, hey, you want to go out and do some, some drugs? I'm like, no, I don't really want to do that. And I'm like, I'm trying to say no. And these guys like, no, you should, you should. And I'm like, dude, that's not going to kill you at some point in time in your life. And I just, I can't believe that you know, I just can't believe that people treat each other, like, you think about TV shows where, you know, someone will write, like, a fag, or, it, it, people don't realize how much words, small, or how big they are, can really hurt each other, and, you know, I know, I send this message out to anyone listening, I don't know if there's a lot of people listening, but I send this message out that you need to treat people much better. I know that you're image of someone else is, is that they're a fag, they're gay, they're whatever. It's not okay. It's not okay. And you need to stop doing that. I, I vote and pledge for a day, just like Bono says, uh, a day out for to end brutal poverty. A day to end brutal bullying, which leads to killing of people. I, I'm, I'm so for that. I'm so for, for ending bullying. Um, you know, you see so many videos, you see so many kids, like that video, that movie, I haven't seen the full movie yet, but it's about bullying, this kid got bullied, and he killed himself, because he couldn't, he couldn't take the, the, the pain of, the pressure of, hey, I'm going to school, I'm trying to learn this, this math, and science, and, and the universe, and stuff, and he's enjoy, enjoying time, Every time he goes into school, it's like, hey, what's up, doofus? What's up? Uh, you know, whatever. And 
you, you see, this is why sometimes I, I watch these younger kids shows because I, I can just see it happening again and again and again and again and you see how tr uh, people treat, it's, it's all, like I said, all it's all in how you treat people. If you treat people nicely and you treat people with respect. Now respect isn't just, hey what's up, it's respect is knowing where they come from, not where they live, just where they, the, the like that they they have no what real real happens in real life and that kind of stuff and they don't and they know all the, like then you know where they come from in their own sense of, of the word um no one really watches no one really um like that's what that's what real um stuff that's what that means is it means that, that you have you know where that person's coming from that's respect um, when you have respect for someone, you don't call them names and push them around and, and, and make fun of them. I mean, you know, I watch some kids shows, not like children shows, like, I watch some because I just, I, I'm hoping that what happens to me or happened to me growing up or other people doesn't happen anymore, but every, every TV show I watch is like, someone writes like fag or gay or stupid or whatever on someone's locker or someone's whatever right and it's it's the, then the person goes back to the locker or back to wh however that happened and good and, and it wasn't good it wasn't good at all I'm not a guy who's gonna walk around and say hey, you, you're asshole you're stupid you're you know I don't I don't walk around to do that I'm a guy who's like you know hey you're nice you look really nice you look beautiful you look really good you do well so I, I'm not I'm not part of that bullying thing. I've never bullied ever in my life, unless it was. But I did. If I did, I did it in a nicer way. I said, Hey, you know, I, I want to go by myself because I don't my you know my mom and dad were, were away or something. I, I'm not very good with making my own stuff. I need some change to buy a a, a, a thing of of like a chocolate bar or whatever. And you know, I say, Okay, hey, can I? Please borrow a couple, like ten cents or twenty-five cents, which is fine. But, but you know, you see people in high school always like, hey, give me lunch, give me lunch. I mean, it's not gonna work out like that. You could just what you could just do, just say, hey, you know, I'm kind of out of money. I my mom left me or my you know whatever. C could you help me? You know, it's a, it's the same thing that could happen help in, in the rule too of like people who steal, people who kill and that kind of stuff. Like people who steal, hey you know, go, or you just go run into a bank and they put a gun to someone's head and say, hey, give me all your money. I just, I don't, I know that we don't want to talk about that a lot, but I know what the backstory is. Is that you're out of money, you feel compelled to do something, and you put people's lives in in dangerous way. And that is not good. That is not good at all. Uh, could you not just say, hey, you know, I'm dealing with, go into one of those, one of those dark bank and just say, hey, you know, without a gun, just go in and say, that, hey, I got this problem. I don't have a lot of money. Um, job, just, I lost my job. Or That's a lot better than coming in with a gun and loaded gun and, and, and putting, you know, saying, hey, we're going to get to the ground and, I, I just don't let, you see how I, how I did my thing, I was like, I said I had a couple cents, a couple, you know, that was my bullying, but it wasn't bullying, it wasn't calling people gay, it wasn't calling people stupid, it was calling, you know, be nice to people, if you be nice to people, people will love you back, you be good to people, people will love you back, and that's, that's my last moment for um, YouTube, uh, have yourself a wonderful night. Uh,